straight into this recipe. You know y'all like when I get to it and not be wasting time. This is my spice. It's lit lemon pepper. It should be in your house. I don't know why it's not. Today I'm making honey lemon pepper chicken nuggets. Quote, quote, chicken nuggets. Because, you know, child, these pieces of chicken are cut really big. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm also make, putting on here some smoked paprika because, you know, we are frying chicken. So you want that smoky background. And that's why I'm using it. I'm also going to go in here with some buttermilk and not too much. Y'all be flooding y'all chicken with the buttermilk just enough to get it nice and coated um, because I'm not going to use any eggs. So this is the marinade. I'm going to let, let it marinate for about mm, about four hours you could it'll be great if you do it overnight but i don't have that much time i'm hungry i'm cleaning i'm cooking i'm getting ready for you know my supporters this weekend dropping these packages off so i'm just getting it out the way <laughs> so till the batter is going to be flour cornstarch a little black pepper and some adobo not too much you guys know if you've ever ordered my lemon pepper is very seasoned so you don't need a lot of seasoning you don't need a lot a lot of salt and i'll get back to that in just a minute minute so i'm going to mix that up right here and set it to the to the side all right so uh, you're just going to take your chicken pieces and drop it into your flour mixture and that's it I mean, I'm keeping it simple. They still came out crispy and they were delicious, you guys. It didn't even need the honey mixture. It was so delicious. And if you have my lemon pepper in your house, just make sure you pop it open <laughs> and get the going. Again, each video, I know y'all don't like it, but I have to mention it because I have a lot of newcomers weekly. I do have braces and I have a stronger lisp with the braces as well as you know it, it affects my speech a little bit so just forgive me they're coming off very soon so you know yeah so you want to get the flour and the cornstarch mixture on there really good it's going to develop those nooks and crannies the more you mix it so don't just pop it in there and take it out really get the flour and cornstarch on the chicken pieces and then you're just going to repeat the process uh, the reason why I put them on a plate because I want them to sit before I fry them. I didn't even heat my oil yet. So they're probably going to be sitting here for about 10 minutes before I fry them. For the honey butter sauce, you want to use some good butter because you are just pouring this over your chicken. So don't get the super, super cheap stuff, guys. Try to get something a little, you know, a little more sturdy and rich. <laughs> so I'm going to add my It's Lit Lemon Pepper, period. Y'all see that lemon pepper? Ha! <laughs> please now anyway you want to add it to your butter as well as some honey get some good honey well the best you can afford i'm not being funny or shady you know we're all living in a hard time right now but certain things i just cannot skimp on i cannot buy cheap butter and i can't buy cheap honey um those are i, I don't compromise that <laughs> while that's sitting to the side i'm gonna make some lemonade y'all know how to make lemonade already but i just wanted to show y'all don't laugh at my picture it's very old. My father actually gave me this picture set um, many years ago before he passed, and I kept it. Um, so it's very, very old. <laughs> um, but, you know, you know, you know how that goes. And uh, so now I'm going to add some lime juice, some lemon juice, and some sugar, and that's the lemonade. So that's for anybody that don't know how to make lemonade. That's it. Lemon, lime, water, sugar. And you're good. And uh, I'm going to mix this up really well and put it in the freezer while we fry the chicken. And that's pretty much it. So my oil is about mm, 375 because, you know, once you add the chicken, the temp is going to fall. So make sure your oil is above 350. Now, 400 and 450 is way too high, but at least 375. All right, it comes out looking like this, nice and golden. I know y'all love y'all fish fry Friday, but we frying chicken today, honey. And look how crispy and golden and beautiful. You can see the spice on there. Um, this was so easy to make because I only used one spice. I only used my spice, lemon pepper. I didn't use anything else but the smoked paprika. And when I tasted one of these, y'all, it didn't need nothing else. It's so crazy. <laughs> it's so crazy to me. It really didn't need anything else, but you know. I wanted some sauce. I didn't have anything in the house to make a dipping sauce. So I said, I have honey. Why not? So this is me pouring the honey all over the chicken. Like, ooh, if y'all don't make this recipe, Thanksgiving around the corner. 
you can make this for an appetizer or something because honey this chicken was so delicious and crispy slightly sweet it had a kick just so good that's my lemonade with some apples and this is the chicken right here one more time um like i said you know oh by the way i drizzled it drizzled it on because i didn't want to soak the chicken i didn't want it to lose its crispiness but if you want to toss it in all that honey and butter and everything that's fine too but i just wanted to drizzle just enough you know but thank you guys so much for watching i love you for your support and i'll catch you on my next video bye